Hi friends, how are you? Welcome back. Today, we are going to see how salts are made. It's really interesting to know and proud to say India is the third largest country in salt production. So come, we will see each steps and some informations. India is the largest salt producing country in the world after China and USA, with global annual production being about 230 million tons. Commercial salt is manufactured from rock salt as well as from seawater and other natural and artificial brines. The major salt producing centers are marine salt works along the coast of Gujarat, Tamil Nadu, Andhra Pradesh, Maharashtra, Orissa and West Bengal. Inland salt works in Rajasthan using lake brine and subsoil brine. Gujarat is the largest salt producer state of India and third largest in the world. The state contributes 76% to the total salt production in India. Tamil Nadu is the second largest producer of salt in India after Gujarat. The state contributes 12% to Uthkuri, Ramanathapuram, Nagapatnam, Villapuram and Kanjipuram are the major salt producing districts. The simplest method of evaporating brine is solar evaporation, but it can only be used in hot, dry, sunny places. The brine is collected into shallow ponds and allowed to evaporate in the sun. Insoluble impurities such as sand and clay and slightly soluble impurities such as calcium carbonate settle to the bottom as evaporation begins. The brine is pumped or moved by gravity flow to another pond where calcium sulfate settles out as evaporation continues. The remaining brine is moved to yet another pond where the salt settles out as evaporation proceeds. The brine is moved one more time before evaporation is complete to prevent highly soluble impurities such as magnesium chloride, magnesium sulfate, potassium chloride and magnesium bromide from settling out with the salt. These substances may be collected separately for commercial use. The salt settles at temperatures of 24 to 25 degrees. The salt is scooped up by machines running on temporary railroad tracks laid on top of the layer of salt. It is then washed with highly concentrated salt water. This water contains so much salt that it cannot hold any more, so the salt is washed free of any trace impurities without dissolving. The washed salt is removed from the salt water, rinsed with a small amount of fresh water and piled into huge stacks to drain for 2 or 3 months. This salt is about 99.8% pure and can be used for food processing. Friends, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, share and comment. See you in the next video. Until then, be happy and be safe.